Good evening and welcome to NPL Victoria. It is round four of the competition. Friday night football coming your way from Olympic Village. Tonight's combatants, Heidelberg United and Green Gully, both shooting for a third win of the season from four starts. These two sides that fell outside the top six in 2023 are shooting. Doing a good spell of possession so far, both of these teams, averaging over 50% of the football in their matches. It's going to be an interesting contest to see that they match up against each other tonight, Neil. Yeah, absolutely. Both ball-dominant teams and JA's influence uh, on this side is, is becoming very apparent early on. Uh, if you were to put this side up against the, the great Bentley teams of old, you wouldn't see much of a difference in, in the way that they like to flow and, and progress the ball forward. So you see Yabakawa now. It's Shepard. So that's his option. He looks towards the left-hand side and does find Hippolytus. You can't find pass on that occasion. Yep, power up into the midfield. Olsen. Approaching the box. Just unfortunately can't quite swing it through towards Josh Pin. Having a bit of trouble here. Gully looking to clear the ball away. Let's get back, we're back to goal. Sevilla. And Swivel his way through. A bit impatient from Brigade Parks and here's the chance for the Burgers. Shepard turn in the centre circle of Olympic Village and spray this one out to Nikolaitis. Here's Leo Mazes in space, down near the byline. He's got Pin in the middle. Kakawa arriving as well. Well away by Shrivers. Only as far as Shepard, and it's just over the bar from Kane Shepard. A dipping effort and a warning shot fired by the Burgers captain. He's a fairly underrated player in, by, many, uh, by many strengths, I would say. Also arriving in the MPL Queensland and also via clubs in Victoria as well. Being of a very notable fray is Shepard looks to race through a goal here, and Shrivers has brought him down here. Michael Mammus has gone into his back pocket and given him a red card. And that is the tone setter of tone setters. Green Gully's captain is off. Wow, huge mistake by Shrivers, and he pays the ultimate price trying to redeem himself. Michael Mammus. Well, he didn't really have a lot of options there, Neil. Egyptian-born defender, 25 years of age, 13 involvement in the matchday squad at Gully last season. It's a chance here to do his thing for the bulk of this match. Here's Adara. And in. It is in by Pitt. Heidelberg take full advantage. It's 1-0 to the Burgers. Only 25 minutes on the clock. And Gully's Friday night is in tatters. And it's great for the Burgers as the home fans rejoice, Neil. That is excellent for Moai Dara. Such sumptuous quality on the ball. And to flick that across to Josh Pin. It was coming. When you uh, go down a player, it's very hard to compose yourself from a defensive position. And... Abdel Kuku, dare I say, a baptism of fire. Yeah, the Hoki Cannons have indeed equalised. It's also towards the centre, and Shepard arriving there. It finds at the back post Ben Collins. A debut goal for Heidelberg United, number three. And a reunited John Anastasiadis and Ben Collins can rejoice as they take the 2 0 lead over Green Gully. It was coming. Welcome back for the second half. Piel Victoria, round four. Heidelberg United leading Green Gully Cavaliers two goals to nil. In Friday night football from Olympic Village getting the round started. The Burgers getting the job done so far. Steve Curtin and Neil Simons with you for the second half of this one. Players are back out on the park and it will be Green Gully to kick us off. And uh, welcome back to the commentary for the second 45. Neil Simons. By Liam Driscoll. Cavaliers just one shot in anger so far tonight. Could they be on for a second here? Perhaps this is Josh Hope going his own way 
And what a great solo effort that could have been as he beats the ground in disappointment. He had a couple of players to beat, as well as Yaron Souza. Tracked the ball through the air, got to the fall of it. Did a lot of the hard work too, in fact. Couldn't fire it past the Heidelberg shot stopper, who was quite grateful to receive that one into the gloves for his first save of the match, Neil. Yeah, it's, it's really hard to believe that Yaron Souza's only had to make one save. I guess if you want to call that cross uh, across the face earlier on, say you could, but we'll see Mazes now drifting onto his right. It's Leo Mazes. It's well defended by Justin Spiteri. He finds Kudakbo now with a good first touch. Despite having his senior side go two goals behind already in the first 68 minutes here. Kadakpo using his strength to shield the ball, but Jamal Ali is having an excellent game tonight. Showing his versatility as well, Neil, moving from right back, now left back. You can play anywhere across the back four and wherever you're playing. Oh, it's a big turn over here. Here's Pin. Mays at the top of the box, and Olsen is there! In fact, it may actually be the substitute, Neil. Sean Ellis. Burgess, a three to the good. Well, you mentioned uh, Leo Josh has had a great game. The commentator's curse strikes, strikes. again. It's uh, Josh Pinn receiving the ball on the byline. He eventually finds Sean Ellis. Heidelberg's hero, the Scotsman, delivering once again. And that is just the icing on the cake. Sean Ellis slotting away. 69th minutes. Forward, playing direct. Able to find. Yes, don't uh, adjust your sense. Julie will be making the forward run again, and that's time. Michael Mammis is called a stop to this one, and it's a triumphant night for the Heidelberg United Warriors. 3 0 winners in a match that was touted as one of the games of the round. Two teams in top form contending for this year's finals. And it has been a yellow and black whitewash tonight, Neil. Fantastic performance. Goals coming from Josh Penn, as well as Ben Collins and Sean Ellis. Not a great night for Gully, but it's great, great stuff for Heidelberg United, Neil.